Because working with uh, an assistant, it seems like you have it down. How do you communicate best and how often with your assistant? Like I could run my entire business from my, from my cell phone on Slack. Let's just message in Slack unless I'm on the road and then I'm not checking anything, then call me, email you know, me, like, let's, let's do it that way. And I tell her that I'm not gonna sugarcoat things. Don't take things personally. If I really didn't like what you were doing, I'd fire you, right? Like, I mean, people think you're gonna hire an assistant and you're instantly just gonna move on to a million free hours. The first three months of an assistant is actually draining to the point where like sometimes you'll, you'll question, is this even worth it? Because everything that I do now, I have to film a Loom video, you have to walk through the step. I now need her to recreate that as a, as a SOP. She now has to turn that into an SOP so that she could train someone else. And then I need to review that SOP. Uh, but it is a lot of work and a lot of communication. So if you're not a good communicator, you're gonna have a tough time in the beginning, but it's worth it.